We're going to be using Pro Tools for this video today, but what you're going to see applies to other DAWs too. If you need instructions on how to get your audio in and out of Vocaline Ultra with another DAW, please check out the relevant tutorials on our website. Before we get started, let's have a listen. Oh big boy, you really went and broke my heart, I'm no toy. And now we're selling lights up bar, you got some growing up to do, had a lucky escape from you. Oh big boy, you got a tiny, tiny heart. Our first step is to launch Vocaline Ultra as an audio suite plugin in Pro Tools. As the GUI is fully resizable, I'm just going to quickly adjust to a size that I'm happy working with. Before we start transferring our vocals from our DAW into Vocaline Ultra, it's worth noting that to get the best results, the audio files we capture should always be roughly the same length. So first I'm going to capture the vocal I want to use as a guide, in this case, that's my lead vocal. Then I capture the first dub which I want to conform to the guide, in this case that's a double. As soon as I've captured my guide and dub, Vocaline Ultra performs the alignment and you can now see a newly created yellow output track in this area here. Another tip here is to adjust these flags so they line up with the sections of the guide and dub signal which you want to align together. Initially, our output track is based on the plugin settings at the time the dub was captured. To get the best results, a good place to start is to select a preset. For this example, I'm going to select vocal, double, slightly loose time and pitch. As you can see, once I change the preset, a new output track is created based on the new settings. And this happens automatically when I change any of the individual parameters too. In Vocaline Ultra, you control how much alignment is applied to the dub signal. So if super tight sounds a little artificial, you can back off this setting and retain a more natural feel. And as we saw when we changed the preset earlier, any adjustments you make are instantly applied. If you look at the output waveform, you can see that the guide signal is overlaid as a blue outline. This enables you to see how closely aligned the guide and the outputs are, which tells you whether the alignment has worked as expected. With Vocaline Ultra, you can also match the pitch of your audio, so there's no need to tune all of your doubles separately. So we've already tuned our lead using Revoice Pro, and now we want our doubles to follow the same pitch. Firstly, let's switch to the advanced panel so we can see all of the available parameters. Then before I start adjusting the match pitch settings, let's activate the pitch display by clicking this button here so we can visually see how our changes are affecting the signal. This display is currently set to show the pitch traces of the guide and output signals. It's also possible to see the dub two by clicking this icon. You can see we're currently in mode one. Similar to how the match timing feature works, in this mode, I can adjust the max difference control and the pitch alignment applied by Vocline Ultra will be tighter or looser. You can see how the pitch traces are changing in the display window as I make adjustments. The tighter the control, the closer the pitch of the two signals become. Mode two works a bit differently as it allows us to match the finer details of the dub pitch separately to the time variable average pitch of the signal. So in mode two, you can pitch align your vocals while still retaining natural characteristics of the dub like vibrato, for example. As I'm using Pro Tools, I can use a preview function in the bottom left of the plugin to audition my audio. If you're using Vocaline Ultra as an ARA2 plugin in a compatible DAW, the audio is automatically updated so there's no need to preview from inside Vocaline. You can just press play in your DAW and instantly hear the results. Let's have a listen to the guide and the new aligned output track. Oh big boy, you really went and broke my heart, I'm no toy And now we set a light to buy, you got some growing up to do Had a lucky escape from you, oh big boy, you got a tiny tiny heart So I'm really happy with the way that's sounding, so now we just need to render our output back into Pro Tools I'm going to replace the original dub with my new output, but you could alternatively render to a new track don't forget that if you're using Vocaline Ultra as an ARA2 plugin, you don't need to render the output as that happens automatically. Now I also have another double here, so I'm just going to capture that and Vocaline Ultra will apply the same alignment settings. Then I can just render that second double back into Pro Tools 2. If I have multiple dubs, all I need to do is keep repeating this process. If I had a harmony instead of a double, I would need to turn off the pitch match setting or select a harmony preset from the menu. However, what I have here is an octave harmony, which I'm going to capture now. 
In the case of an octave harmony, we can still use the match pitch feature. We just need to use mode one and have nearest octave selected in target mode. Then as you can see from the pitch display, Vocaline Ultra still matches the pitch of the dub to the guide, but it keeps them an octave apart. Also in this instance where we have a high octave harmony, we'd recommend you change the dub pitch range to high pitch vocal, which will help Vocaline get better results. Let's preview this quickly and then render back into Pro Tools. Oh big boy, you really went and broke my heart. I'm no toy, and now we're satellites of fire. Vocaline Ultra has some creative features that can help quickly spice up your vocal stack. What I'm gonna do is to duplicate one of these doubles that I've already aligned in Pro Tools and then capture it as a dub in Vocaline Ultra. Then let's try transposing it down very slightly and lower the formant shift to get an extra layer that adds some richness and depth to the sound. Let's preview that to see how it sounds. Oh big boy, you really went and broke my heart. I'm no toy, and now we're satellites of fight. Perfect, now we just need to render the new double I've created back into Pro Tools. So now we have all our newly aligned vocals back in Pro Tools, ready to be heard in context. But first, let's hear what they sounded like before. Oh big boy, you really went and broke my heart I'm no toy, and now we're satellites apart You got some growing up to do, had a lucky escape from you Oh big boy, you got a tiny, tiny heart And now after processing with Vocaline Ultra Oh big boy, you really went and broke my heart I'm no toy and now we satellites up by you got some growing up to do had a lucky escape from you oh big boy you got a tiny tiny heart now that sounds loads better let's hear it with the rest of the track oh big boy you really went and broke my heart i'm no toy and now we satellites up by you got some growing up to do had a lucky escape from you oh big boy you got a tiny, tiny heart. I hope you found that useful. Thanks for watching and head over to our website for more tutorials.